Okay, we are on finance chapter, the topic of financial mathematics. So now, okay, just change things up. Now we are using, well, for this chapter, we'll be using platinum textbook. So, exercise one on chapter four, yeah. Okay, let us try it. Number one, determine the rate of depression. Okay. For an item to become a quarter of its original value after nine years. Okay, about 1.1. Using straight line method of depreciation. The straight line is that one which one can say is the vice versa of simple interest. Like the simple interest says 1 plus i n. Then for this one, it will be 1 minus. That's the only difference. And then the given value a, p, i, then n. Okay, I is what you are calculating. We don't know what it is. And then N are given as 9 years. And then the principal amount. A. And then what is A? It says, what it is? For an item to become quarter of its original. Quarter of its original. The original value here for, for P. Remember, P, it is the now of A, and then A, it is the after of P. Like, it's, if you can say P is now, then two years later, that will be A. Otherwise, it's the same thing, just that this one is for now, this one is for later on, right? So, it says for later on to become or a quarter. Later on to become a quarter. For now, it's still A. I hope you get it. Then, now... Uh, Let's substitute for A, it's 1 over 4A equals to 4P, that's the A. And then 1 minus I is what you are calculating, N is 9. Then divide both sides by A, divide by A, cancel, cancel, cancel. So we 1 over 4 equals to 1 minus 9I. Then subtract. Okay, let's just write 1 over 4 minus 1 equals to 1 minus 1. Subtract 1 from both sides. Minus 9i. And then 1 over 4 minus 1. That is negative 3 over 4. Negative 9i. Remember, this will cancel out. Uh, and then divide both sides by negative 9, so I have negative 3 over 4, divided by negative 9 equals to i. Yeah, therefore, i equals to 8.25, and then it's round off. It says it should round off to one decimal place, so it will be i, equal, I equals to 8.3. And then I remember is given by percent. Yes. Done. Okay, that was 1.2. Oh, it's still the same question, but this time we're using the reducing balance method. Reducing balance, you can also say is the vice versa of that one of compound interest. So instead of 1 plus I to the N, you will say 1 minus I to the N. And then these values are still the same with this one, so we okay, can just okay. drag this. Yes, yeah, yeah, it's still the same thing. A is one over four. Yeah, equals to a. Hey, sorry. One minus i is what you are looking for. Then n. Oh, this time is a bit different. Uh, okay, we're not told whether it's compounding monthly or annually, so it's still fine. So, I I wanted to say over whatever it is compounded, if monthly or quarterly, to become, no, it didn't say anything about that. So, we assume it's, or we take it as annual, then n becomes 9 times. Okay. Divide both sides by a, 1 over 4a over a, and cast to the right hand side over a, cancel, 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 then we have 1 over 4 equals to 1 minus i, 
to the nine. Then we use okay, raise both sides to the one over nine. It's one minus i, sorry, not to the one. Oh, it's actually nine. Then to the one over nine. We used one over nine so that you can cancel out the exponent nine here. So we'll have oh that one will rem on the right hand side is one minus i. On the left, on the left to press calculator, one over four. Hey, not 14 4 to the 1 over 9. Okay, when you calculate, you get it as 0 over 8. Uh, okay, let's not factor. Let's not hit a convert. Okay, round off now. Let's wait. 8, 5, 7. Yeah, then they subtract one both sides, it will be 0 0.857. Actually, you can write even through minus 1 equals to 1 minus 1 minus i. This side will cancel left at negative i. Then you subtract minus 1, you get negative 0 0.14. <laughs> Then divide both sides by negative. Let's just divide by negative one. Then again, therefore, we'll have i equal to zero comma. Yeah, that's when we can round off one four. Mm, one four three. But you don't have to round off yet. Well, then multiply by hundred because you need it as a percentage. Therefore, this becomes times 100. 40. Oh, it's negative. Yeah, it's 40. Negative one, you cancel out here. 14.28. Then, uh, to one decimal place, this will be. Ah, actually, you should just write. Okay, sharp. 40, comma 3. Yeah, uh, the next question, number 2. Determine the length of time. So we are calculating n. The length of time it will take for investment of 520k to become a 60k. Uh, if the simple interest rate, well, we can give you answer to correct. Simple interest rate. So simple interest a equals to p1 plus i n. <coughs> Uh, given information, okay, let's, A is, <laughs> let's just write it here, I'll drag it. <laughs> A, oh, to become, what it becomes, remember A is after, the now is P, A is 860, K, K means does, then, uh, is 520 hey, this fool is doing something else then i is 12 percent or we can simplify this 12 over 100 which is 0 cover 1 2 <laughs> and then we are calculating n remember taking information from question number 2 then let us drag these things Let's simplify a. Ah, it's. Ah, it's. Ah, it's. Ah, it's. Ah, it's. Ah, it's. Ah, and then n is what you're looking for. 
And I did a kill it off. Okay. This is multiplication. Okay. Divide both sides by five trade five. I divide both sides by this five hundred and twenty thou. This is five twenty thou. It goes to okay. Five twenty thou. One plus zero point one two and cancel cancel. So on the left we have eight sixty one two three over five twenty one two three. So it's forty three over twenty six goes to one plus zero one one two and yeah. Ah. Yeah. Try to solve for n. Subtract one both sides is 43 over 26 minus 1 equals to 1 minus 1 plus 0 0.12 n. Uh, this cancels the left is positive 2. 0, 1, 2, n. And then 43 over 26 minus 1. 17 over 26 then divide both sides by 0, 0,12 so 17 over 26 everything over 0, 0.12 equals to 0, 0,12 n over 0, 0,12 cancel cancel therefore n equals to divided by 0, 0.12 and equals to 5,448 then you round off it will be 5,5 so I think it will say it's 5 and a half years alright 5,5 yes then <coughs> and this video will be longer for you to, for the sake of your data let us do number 3 number 4 in the next video part 2 of this